The TPM philosophy can be a culture shock to traditional Theory X organizations. Employee empowerment, operator ownership, teamwork, and autonomous management will be challenging concepts to supervisors who confuse sharing responsibility with the loss of power and view empowering operators as an encroachment on their domain. I can talk about myself. I remember, oh, six, seven years ago, if you'd have said, let an operator touch a machine, I'd have screamed and said, no, we're not going to do that. They're not qualified, they're not trained, they don't know what they're doing. At the Magnavox Electronic Systems Company in Fort Wayne, Indiana, these attitudes have changed. Through their TPM certification program, teams are achieving autonomous management. They've expanded their preventive maintenance responsibilities, improved their equipment and processes, rearranged their work areas, and have been instrumental in the purchase of production equipment. Their path to autonomous management starts with equipment data gathering, teamwork training, and team formation. The team receives basic TPM training on subjects like baselines and measurements, the OEE, and visual controls. They perform an initial cleaning, identify and resolve defects, and set their own goals and standards. All teams receive the same safety training, but machine setup and operation is unique to each work cell. Workshops supplement the basic TPM training and help improve equipment and processes by focusing on meeting team goals and standards. And inspections and audits, usually conducted by other teams, determine when a team is certified. While Magnavox endorses this process flow, it is the team that determines their rate of progress.